is Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom and have I got a haul for you today. Um, I've got a lot of really great stuff. Um, I'm going to jump in. I'm going to start off with the shop stuff and then I'll finish with the actual like Happy Planner brand stuff at the end. Alright, so the first shop that we are going to be checking out is Lil Annabelle's Plans, and I do have a coupon code for her shop. It is Brittany25, and that'll get you 25% off your order with her. So, I was so excited when I saw Lil Annabelle sitting in my mailbox the other day. It was definitely welcomed happy mail. So the first sheet of stickers that we have is her stacks of books, which I'm really excited about. We go every week to the library. So these top two are just plain books. These say trip to the library, currently reading and books. Then we have more books because like I said, we go every week. Um, so these are the multicolored. So you have some that are a little bit more bright, some that are more neutral. Um, I, I love it. I love the fact that you get a like a bright colored one and a pastel with each. So this is the multicolor. Then we have Lucia's books. I love Lucia because she has the, like the main character has the dark brown hair. So I have dark brown hair now, used to be blonde, but it is brown. Um, so I always get Lucia, it's got the pony because it just kind of reminds me of me. So this is a sheet of Lucia with those books. Then I got this. So this is the remember hand. I just think that it's really, really useful to have this because like it can, you can use it to denote pretty much anything in your planner. So if you don't have a sticker that's like specifically for something, this will be a really good fill in. So I'm very excited to have this. Then, oh my gosh, yes, I'm really excited about this. So we have our Soccer Rosie stickers. So we have the two different sizes. Um, and then now she's actually, she has some facing to the left, some facing to the right, so that it changes. But we also have the Tay Tay Bear soccer stickers because my son is going to be doing soccer in the fall too. So now I'll be able to know just by looking at the sticker if it's a his game or a hers game. Then I have these quarter box stickers and these are, like I said, these are also Lucia and they are the pastel colors. So I, I love that they all just kind of go together. So this is really exciting. You got her, some of them she's over here on the left, some of them she's on the right. And yep, yeah, that's just my journaling card. Forgot about that. Um, but that is my order from Lil Annabelle's Plants. Next up is my very first order ever with Simply Gilded. Um, so I left it in the packaging. I love this cute little bunny. It is so cute. Um, but I didn't want to take it out of the packaging, but now I'm kind of thinking maybe I should have. I was trying to save the bunny and I was struggling, so I just cut the bag because, yeah. Um, so in... In my order, I also got this bow sticker, and it looks like it's got silver foil. I don't think that's blue. I think that's just my eyes playing tricks on me. So it is a really pretty, like, deep-colored bow. Um, and then I got some washi. So I actually participated in the late March, early April pre-sale that she did. So these were all pre-sale washi. So we have this card that says... Happy Mail is such a cute little owl with his glasses. Ooh, are you guys getting, yes, you are getting that. It is a rainbow foil, so adorable. Now, I'm not going to open these up, but I am going to show you what I got. So this, and I probably should have saved, I had to get a cheat sheet. Um, so this is the light pink with champagne gold bows. So this one is the 15 millimeter and then this one is the 10 millimeter. So I had to double check. Um, so I've seen quite a few people using Simply Gilded and the whole rush of ordering kind of terrifies me. So when she did the pre-sale, that's why I finally decided to go ahead and grab her washi. Then this one is lilac with, I think it's silver. So silver bows, 
really pretty. Oh, there, now you can kind of get a better look without a glare. So that is lilac with silver. And then this one has, is it aqua? Yes, aqua and then a silver hollow. So you can see like the holographic. So yeah, so that's pretty. This one I can really imagine that I'm going to get a lot of use of out of the summer because it's so bright. Um, I've been really into purple lately, so I'm probably going to end up getting really heavy use out of this and you really can't go wrong with pink. So that is my order from Simply Gilded. All right, and now we're gonna jump into all of the Mambi stuff. I have it all kind of set off to the side because it really is a ton of stuff. Um, so I got everything from different places. So the washi that I have here, this is three millimeter, and to kind of give you an idea, like this is the five millimeter from Simply Gilded that I just showed. So this is a little bit thicker, I would say, than like a header. So you can get an idea of just how skinny these are. Um, so this one is the Brights color, and you got some foil on all of them. It's kind of, yeah. So these are the Brights. This one I was really excited about because it's the Jewel Tone. So it's like really deep, dark colors, which goes with my Happy Planner because I have the Boho Deep Tones. So the Jewels, I just thought it was a really perfect match. And then I couldn't pass up the Pastels. Just think that they are really cute so those are the washies I did pick up there we go it's in focus I did pick up some rose gold discs so these are just the classic size um, I just wanted to have an extra set of discs because I feel like I've been using discs a lot all right so I forgot to mention the washi came from Joann's the discs I got at Michael's and then these are the whole reason why I went to Joann's let me bring you in all right, there we go. So these are, each one is a, like each sheet has full box stickers. So it's either a single full box or a double full box. So this one right here is the Fun Florals. And some of them have like gold foiling, which I'm really excited about. So I've been getting really into florals and I'll just go kind of on the quicker side, um, just so that you can see. But I've been really into florals lately. So I thought that, I couldn't pass this one up and it's got more of like the pastel colors so I just figured that was pretty pretty perfect and then like they match like each set per sheet matches so you could use them to coordinate in one spread so here's what I was saying about double boxes so I'm not gonna talk too much about them but they are really cute and I just didn't want to pass it up so there are several different ones. There's one more that I did not get. Um, I don't remember the name of it. It was like, I think like, kind of like a goal getter type of a thing. Not like the Happy Planner Girl goal getter, um, but it had a lot of like black and white and gold, um, very like girl boss centric. And I'm like, ah, I'm a stay at home mom. So I skipped on that one, but I do have all of the others that were on the shelf. So that was the fun florals. Then we have the holidays and seasons, um, just because, why not? I like holiday stickers. So you've got like the blues for winter. You've got some more Christmassy ones, wild at heart, love you a latte. So this is more like Valentine's Day. So quite a few Valentine's Day. Then we get into more of like the spring but then you also have St. Patrick's Day. I don't usually decorate for St. Patrick's Day because my daughter's birthday is the day after. Um, so I usually try to decorate more for her. So those are more springy. Then we get into summer. I love that lemonade. It makes me really thirsty right now. And I have these in my freezer right now. Should probably have one. That would be really good. Um, and then we're coming into the fall. So I like that they have just plain fall. And then here... Oops, skipped one. Here we go. Here's some Halloween and then more Thanksgiving-y type stuff. Definitely Thanksgiving-y because it's grateful for. And then we're back to Christmas again. So I'm going to have to try to make sure I don't forget that there's Christmas at the back of this sticker book when I am using it. So that's the, what is it? Not dates and holidays. Holidays and seasons. 
lovely pastels. I'm so looking forward to this. And then is this? Yes, 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 yes. It is rose gold foil. Um, so I didn't mention this, but all of these stickers are on matte paper, so they are not not clear sticker paper or anything like that. So you can write on all of these if you wanted to. Some of them are meant for writing. Oh, so it's not all rose gold because that is definitely more of like a hollow. Very cute. And like I said, this one is the pastel book. Oop. Skip to page. I do have some of the regular sticker books coming up as well in this haul haul and some other fun stuff but like I said I got all of these at Joann's except for the next one but I'll explain that um check on the Joann's websites though because two of the Joann's in my areas did not carry this but the third one did so I had to drive a little bit further uh to get my hands on these and because of that I kept waiting until I saw them labeled as in stock on the website um so that's why it just took me so long to get my hands on these because I was waiting for them to come in stock. This one is available at Joann's, but my fantastic sister-in-law knew that I was on the hunt for these and had an extra one, and so she gave it to me, which I love. Oh my gosh, we got more popsicles over here. So this one, what did I say? Bold and bright. So very summery, because you know me, I have been talking all this time about, in all of my plan with me's, about how, um, these bright, bold colors are just very summery to me, and there's a whole reason why I bought like the Trendsetter. This is a cover for one of the, I think it's the Memory Planners, the Memory Keepings. Um, I love that pattern, so I'm really excited to have it as a sticker. I like the basic black and white, too. You got some gold foil here. Ooh, this one's like an entirely gold foiled sticker. I like that a lot. Pretty colors. I need to do like a rainbowy theme. I totally could now that I have this sticker book. Oh, I love the teal. That's such a pretty color, too. And like I said, some of these stickers you can write on. And here's another one that's meant for writing. All right, and then that's it for these. I think that they just call them the tiny sticker books. So it says sticker pad. Then I got these um, filler paper. These are actually sized for the mini. It is just kind of plain. They did my Joann's that I went to didn't have a huge selection. I know the one that I usually go to has a bigger selection for like these sorts of accessories. So I'll have to go there, but I saw plain note paper and I just wanted to get my hands on it. So this is, it comes two different styles in this 40 page pack. So this is just regular lined and then we have grid. Can you see it? Yeah, it's grid. So like I said, these are size for the mini happy planner. Now we're gonna get into the rest of the Michaels portion. Like I said, I got the disc set Michaels and then I got this box because it was actually on clearance, which is so funny because the Joann's website labeled these as new stock and these are old stock at Michaels. So if you're shopping for things, definitely check out the different stores that carry the products so that you can make sure that you're getting the best deal because these are regularly $10 and they were clearanced for 60% off. I only got one, I got the wellness box, and that is because, and I'm not gonna pull them out because there's like a special way to set this up and I don't wanna mess it up on camera. Um, but the whole reason I got this is because it has 136 habit trackers. Um, and I'm kinda interested in using these. I know that there's only 16. Um, so there's two colors, so it shows you on the backs of the boxes like all of the color schemes that it comes in. So it's kind of more of like a pastel, but also like a bright color. I don't even know how it can be like a bright pastel, but yeah. And then it's just got some little quote hexagons. These are meant for your sidebar, some flags, and then some listy boxes. All right, and now we have full-size sticker books. So I have three sticker books. I'm going to use, I'm gonna go in order from like the newest to the oldest. Uh, because I have the seasonal from this most recent release, I have the colorful boxes from the last release, and then I have the rainbow book from forever ago, but I finally got my hands on it. So like I said, we'll start off with seasonal. If there's any pages that have like quotes and stuff, I'll try to pause so that you can pause it if you want to take a look at it. Um, 
But yeah, so for the seasonal book, we're starting off with New Year's, which I'm excited about because you don't see too many New Year's stickers. And then we're doing just plain winter, but you have plenty of like Christmassy things like decorate a tree. But then read by the fire is just regular winter. You have a little winter bucket list sticker up here. And then the banner is Hello Winter. So I'm really excited about that because in the old seasonal sticker book, the banner was bucket list. And that's not something that I was able to utilize. So I'll be able to use that. I like this gift list. I could totally see myself putting this in the um, sidebar somewhere. Oh, I love the colors of this because it's not your typical. Like you've got baby blue, like an ice blue really, and then a light pink. So it's definitely a different color scheme than your like than the last seasonal book. So if you had the other seasonal book, you definitely want to get this one too because it's completely different, just totally revamped. I love this. I don't even like maybe vintage. I don't know. Maybe that's the word I'm looking for. It's more of like a vintage Christmas. I like that so much. I, I just I love Christmas. It's my favorite season. <laughs> Christmas season. Yeah, it really is though. Um, so they changed this up a little bit because in the old one, okay, so in the old one, you got like, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six of each color check flag here. You only get two of each, but you get all of these, which you didn't have. And then you have the different headers, but you had all of the remembers in the green. Whereas here you have a remember in each of the colors and then yeah, so that's just kind of giving you an idea of the differences between that. But flipping on, one of the things that I noticed is that you have these icon pages, but the top half is winter, the bottom half is fall. And then you get into fall, which I am totally loving these right now. So adorable. I love the bike. And then again, you have Hello Fall as the banner instead of the bucket list, but you still have a bucket list sticker. And then these are banners, which is really cute. Thankful and grateful. I could see these, like these stickers going in my monthly sidebar because like I don't really know how to utilize my monthlies all that well. So having, having something like that, I think would be great. This is clear sticker paper. I forgot to mention that on some of the other pages. I'm skipping something. Here we go. So this is that same page that we were talking about. I love the colors that they picked. It definitely, ha like, I, I don't think it's necessarily a vintage, but it definitely has more of a vintage feel to it. Then we get into spring. So I love that they use really vibrant colors over here. So you have like a very like raspberry and then you have like a teal, but then you have like the lighter colors down here at the bottom too, like the more pastel. And then, yeah, oh, that's so cute. I really love the Mambi bike. It is such a cute little graphic. Plenty of full box stickers. I did notice these on some of the other pages. Very, very cute. I hope that I'm giving you guys a chance to pause it if you want to. There's the bike again um, on each page just so that you have a chance to look at each page if you want to. St. Patrick's Day stickers. And then just like in the other seasonal book, you have the Valentine's Day stickers in with the spring, not with winter. Definitely threw me off the first year that I was using the seasonal sticker books. I thought there weren't any Valentine's stickers because I was looking in winter, um, but they are in spring. So now you guys know too for both of them. So again, you have the mix of the season. So you have spring up here and summer down here. So this also gives you an idea of what color scheme you can expect, which I am really loving the blues. Cause like this blue was not terribly prominent in some of the older generations of sticker books, but now they have so many of them. Like it's in the squad goals too. And as someone who has the boho deep tones, planner and there's a lot of that color on the pages. I'm excited to have stickers that'll go with my pages. And like this, I never would have thought to do like a rainbow spread with that blue because this is the blue that I'm working with this month. So yeah, pretty excited. Girls just want to have sun. I love that sticker. I'm so happy I finally have it. 
And then of course you have the flamingos because they're just very summery. Independence Day. Oh, I don't know. I must have missed some of the other holiday stickers. Hopefully there were some. I've got a ton of stuff up here so it doesn't want to stay open. Um, then these are more like you have your happy birthday, just plain celebrate. So I could see myself using these for like anniversaries. I love the balloons. So adorable. And that is it for the seasonal sticker book. All right, now colorful boxes came out in the same release as squad goals. So not this most recent one that came out with like the teacher and the student and the happy kids, um, but the one, the release right before that. So it is a little bit older, but I am finally getting my hands on it. So you have some quarter boxes, some sayings in the middle. These look like they are about two, two full boxes across. These are your half boxes with some checklists. I love the blues and greens and like they definitely coordinate together. These are bigger, like I don't know, maybe like two thirds of a box, three quarters of a box, I don't know. But sometimes you need something bigger. These are more size for your sidebar and then you've got full size squares down here. And then these have lines, this has grid paper. Cause I don't think you can see, and the book is too awkward for me with my tripod where it is to lift it. Um, so you have lines, graph, dot grid, lines and graph paper. And then you've got hexagons, which I think hexagons are really cute. And then you get into, so those are like the cool blues and greens and you get into the reds and pinks. And the setup for the pages are all pretty much the same. So as far as like the sizes go, I don't know about the uh, quotes in the center, but these are definitely your warmer colors. These two kind of have like an ombre to them. Then you get into your cooler like pinks and purples with the blues. This is definitely more of like an ice blue. And then you've got your half boxes. I'm struggling to turn the pages, so that's why this isn't going as quickly as you would expect. So the square boxes, sidebar stickers, full box writables, black. I love it. This way you have just some basic black. When I use like black ink, I can easily use black stickers, but I always kind of forget about them. So at least having them in here would be really useful. I can't tell you how excited I am about having foiled boxes. Like, yeah, seriously, I'm so beyond excited about the foil boxes right now. So plenty of those and the fact that they come sidebar size. I mean, like, yes. Yes, I'm so happy for that. I wonder, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm, I could probably use that for my meal planning in the sidebar. It's got eight lines, but then I would have to actually like write dinner or I could use, oh, and look, this is silver. Um, or I could use a quarter box to cover up part of it to make it a little bit pretty and just give it a little more dimension. So these are all silver foiled and that is the sheet for colorful boxes. And then last up we have the rainbow sticker book. So um, I, like I said, I got all of these at Michael's because they were having that sale where they were $7.50 each. So I couldn't say no. So I'm happy to have this because now I have more like just colors that I can like bring in. Cause sometimes I'm like, oh, I need a sticker that's this color. And I was struggling in my mini earlier today. Um, cause I filmed this week's mini today, right before filming this. Um, and I was like, oh, I could have used the colorful boxes. I could have, you know, this for some of these, I could have used one of these. This I'm looking forward to because then I can actually do like a rainbow spread. So those were reds. Here's pinks and these actually have gold foil on them, which you know I'm excited about because I love my foiled stickers. A lot of these pages are the same, like these quotes might change from color to color, but you're going to get all of the same functional items per color. So now here's pink again, but this is pink without foil and it's going to have the black instead of the foil or not because here's foil. Call me a liar. Um, clearly I thought I understood this book, but I don't. And then you have your pink full boxes. 
So we've had red, pink, and now we have orange. So like I said, it's all going to be pretty similar. The quotes might be different from shade to shade. Then we get into the yellow. And a yellow has foil. So there was no foil on the orange pages, but foil on the yellow. I'm excited about the yellow because I don't have too much yellow. Then we have green. And this is like, it's not like a, um, like a primary green, or I guess that's not primary, it's secondary. It's not like your deeper green. So I like that because I don't really see myself using like the dark green too much in my planners. I love this shade of blue. This is so beautiful. I could have used this in my main, my classic planner this week, but that's all right. And then you got the gold foil. Definitely could have used that. I love having circle stickers. They are some of my favorite stickers. You've got some more down here. This is like a teal. Really pretty. I'm excited to use these because like I have some that have like steps written in them and I'm like oh that would have been so cute and I could do some sticker surgery to make them work this has gold foil I'm so excited about the polka dots because the polka dot stickers are like my favorite full boxes because they're just so cute this is more of like a periwinkle getting into the blues and then you've got the gold foil I don't even know if there was gold foil on the other pages. This is, it's kind of like a purple. I would say it's more purple than dark blue, but I could probably get it to like pull it off in a dark blue spread too. It's just kind of like a, almost like a chameleon because it could lend itself to either of those shades. But I definitely think it's meant to be, although over here it looks like it's meant to be more blue because of the gold foiling with it. So I don't know, blue, purple, I guess you can be the judge of that. But that is it for the rainbow sticker book. All right, and that does it for my haul. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you found some really cute things that you can get for yourself. And if you haven't already, please be sure to hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos. Uh, follow me over on Instagram so that you can check out my posts over there. And I will see you guys later.